Alright, two more preppers here. It's going to get exciting. We got Russ over there, fully camoed, holding a lifeline to the tree so it don't fall on the bug out location. As you can see, there's the tree. And there is the bug out location. We got some dead trees. It's probably going to fall over anyways. So we decided to have them cut down and we'll have plenty of firewood. Daryl's got to relocate his equipment. Oh, that looks scary. That looks scary right there. Alright guys, it's gonna get scary. Daryl's up there, he got his equipment in place I believe. We got Russ and one of the workers there hanging on to the lifeline to the tree. They're gonna try to pull it when Daryl cuts it. I believe this is an accident waiting to happen. Fortunately, I'm the cameraman, I'll get to see it all. This don't look good. Don't look good at all. That takes some balls right there, I'll tell you. I guess I'm getting it on the camera. Looking scary, looking scary. I think I see it moving. There it goes. She's going. Oh! And I had it live! <laughs> Alright, I'm going to kill the camera. We're going to have to relocate that log. Hope it didn't damage the lift. Looked like it hit right there on the hydraulic pump. Okay, this is working out real well. Can't see Russ, he's in full camouflage today. He looks like a head just floating around the woods. <laughs> Come on, Russ, you can do it, buddy. Hey, oh, look at that, by accident. By accident. I was on purpose. <laughs> That's right. Hey, All right, boys, get her chopped up. I say we just light the tree up and forget about it. Yeah, 
push the joke in. Plant that in the ground, Russ, and make a king size slingshot. We can make a slingshot out of that for a weapon. We'll just plant her in the ground, big, big old rubber band on. Okay, YouTubers, I'm going to shut her down until we get to some more death defying feats here. Hell, can we do one in 45 minutes? 